What's wrong with you two guys? Well, summer's almost over. Yeah, true, but the fall equinox is coming! <laughs> the fall equinox? What's that? You don't know what the fall equinox is? I mean, you know what summer is. Summer happens every year. So does the fall equinox. In fact, without the... You know what? We just need to learn more about the fall equinox, and then you'll see why the fall equinox is so important. The autumnal, or fall equinox, is the beginning of the fall season in the northern hemisphere, and of the spring season in the southern hemisphere. And it occurs at the same exact moment everywhere in the world. So, what is an equinox? The name equinox comes from the Latin words meaning equal and night. This is because day and night are almost exactly the same length of time during the equinox. You see, when the equinox happens, the sun passes over something called the celestial equator, which is an imaginary line from the Earth's equator into space. The equinox happens exactly when the sun's center passes through this line. When the sun crosses the equator from north to south, this is the autumnal or fall equinox. And the vernal equinox happens when it crosses from south to north. After this happens, the sun starts to rise later and darkness or nightfall begins to happen earlier. And this stops during the December solstice and days start to grow longer and nights shorter again. Hey, guess what? Did you know that solstices and equinoxes are related to the seasons each year? That's right, Quinn. In the Northern Hemisphere, the fall equinox starts autumn, or fall, in many places around the world. But in the Southern Hemisphere, it's actually the beginning of spring. And when the autumnal or fall equinox happens in the northern hemisphere, the southern hemisphere calls this the vernal equinox. After the autumnal or fall equinox happens, the northern hemisphere starts to get colder and the sun's rays are not as strong. And that's when plants start dying or they go dormant, which means to kind of go to sleep for the winter and animals will soon begin to start to hibernate. But in the southern hemisphere, the opposite happens because the Earth rotates on its axis with a tilt of 23.4 degrees. And people would not see the different seasons if the Earth did not rotate on a tilted axis. In fact, the length of day and night wouldn't change and temperatures would stay the same so there would be no seasons at all. Hey, guess what? Did you know that the autumnal or fall equinox has been known by people for thousands of years? In the Northern Hemisphere, the fall equinox happens around the dates of September 22nd, 23rd, or 24th each and every year. The winter solstice in December is the shortest day of the year as far as daylight. But then after this, each day, the light starts to last a little bit longer. Hey, guess what? The full moon that happens around the fall equinox is called the harvest moon. And the harvest moon is so bright, farmers can work much later than other days throughout the year. The autumnal equinox is often called the fall equinox in the United States because the leaves fall from deciduous trees during that time of the year. Well, hey, guess what? Now we know all about the fall equinox and why it's so important to the seasons, right? Thanks for watching and make sure you smash that like button. It really helps out our channel. It really does. Make sure you subscribe. Bye. Bye.